So, good afternoon. Good to see you. Uh, we are approaching the fight with uh, Pascal, the second version. Uh, you dominated the first fight. Are there anything? Are there anything you think you should do differently in this second fight that you didn't do in the first fight with Pascal? Um, you know, I, I know just the one thing. I should to win this fight, and I must this fight. Uh, and I'm gonna to do everything what I what I'm doing right now and uh, working on it uh, in, in, in the gym. But I cannot to say, you know, like what I to do, like and uh, for what I, for what I work on. And uh, I think so will be a very interesting uh, thing that uh, he will bring in the ring against me. And I will be already fighting like a, uh, I don't remember this uh, for it depends, depends. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Uh, it will be uh, depends what he will bring in the ring. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I'm gonna to I'm going to do From the pants, like you know, like uh, in the ring. It, for me, each fight, like a street fight, like mm -hmm. just the rules with the uh, boxing rules. You know, like, so. You continue to have a lot of success with your trainer, John David Jackson, and we see that your opponent has changed trainers again since the last time you fought. He spent some time with Roy Jones. Now he's training with Freddie Roach. Do you think changing trainers can help him? at all at this point in his career? Uh, for somebody, uh, probably yes, you know, like, but I, I don't know like what uh, Freddy can uh, change in him, you know, like when he's already 32 years old. He, he could uh, to add something, you know, like something new, something like a strategy, you know, like, but power, no, like it's like, uh, Smarter, no, like he, he can he cannot to be like smarter, harder, like or uh, just a, some some things that can be helps to him still life more in the ring against me. At the press conference, he wanted to go and bring up things that are from the past with the issues with the T-shirt. Do you think this is? a desperate attempt because he doesn't have anything new to bring in the ring so he's trying to bring things from outside of the ring to agitate you to try to change how the fight will go. Uh, yeah, you know like it's uh, it means that he nothing to say more. When you nothing to say, you uh, or to do, you use a low blow, right? Mm -hmm. This was a low blow. Just uh, Mike and comments about uh, the last press conference. Mm -hmm. You've had some time now to adjust living on the west coast uh, versus living back east where you used to live and train. How has the adjustment living in California been for your training? How you know? How have you enjoyed living out here, over here? Uh, it, it's okay. It's uh, no problem because uh, usually uh, one week before the fight, uh, I have to come uh, to this place where I where I uh, where I am fighting, where I have to fight, and uh, it's it's not a big problem. So like. Uh, Wrong understand your question. Uh, where is the be better you, you mean like uh, Florida or uh, yeah. California? Mm -hmm. 
How do you how do you like it? Has it been hard living somewhere else? You know, like else? I'm living there and here. You know, like mm -hmm. just right now my my first part for for for, for this fight uh, here, mm -hmm. with this side. Uh, second part will be there. You know, like with, and for, I, I I don't have uh, any problems with uh, uh, with uh, traveling. You know, like worldwide. Just uh, if uh, if you mean. How can I adjust uh, my uh, my mode uh, to fight for this fight? You know, like I will come like early, like one week before the fight, and I will get uh, adjustment uh, time, weather, everything. With a victory against John Pascal, <clears throat> what message would you like to send to the light heavyweight division, and would you prefer? the toss continue with Andre Ward or moving toward closer to a fight potentially with Adonis Stevenson? You know, right now, first of all, I should to win this fight. I don't want to speak about like what will happen and what will be in future, you know. Like, right now, I have a focus and my goal uh, to kick his ass and uh, shut up his uh, mouth. Mm -hmm. Forever, mm -hmm. because he's really like a spoke and still to speak about uh, about me and uh, to my side like a lot of trash. Mm -hmm. It's like not not respect anybody. I think so. He said that I not respect Canadians fans. It's like not true. How I, I not respect mm -hmm. if. Uh, I fight in there, and I see how uh, they support me, you know, like, and uh, it's it's unbelievable the words from his mouth. Really, really, it's like it's just a low blow, really, mm -hmm. like, because he nothing to say more. Mm -hmm. he, he has nothing to say more, right? Thank you. Yeah, you're